This is the Blue Lightning Orble. Store an Orble Blue Lightning. Uh, I'm working on this, this little rig for a little while. As goes in an RPM counter. Uh, it's driven by two two tordial coils. Uh, it's called in blue LEDs. If the device is going to run over Unity, well, god damn it, it might as well look good. So, let's give it a shot here. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's got an Irish flag in it as well. Just yeah. You can see the RPM counter. Uh, that's, uh, you can handle zero, zero, only as two digits. So that would be 1900 uh, divided by two. Would be, it's about, uh, it's bordering about a thousand RPM there. Uh, it's got a bit of a built flag. Green Hunt Gold. It's just a switch to kill the coils. So. Two cardio coils. Power this device. Uh, it takes a, bit, a little bit of time to. Uh, Wind the tortilla coil, so that's why it's only got two. Well, I can just adjust the speed. Vibrating because uh, the rotor is a little bit off balance. Yeah. That's it. Storm Orbo Blue Lightning. But it's not going to run over the energy, so I doubt it might as well look good. Little or no power out of this device. Little or no power, and I just uh, let's see how this is constructed. So it's a pair of a pair of mag uh, magnets strapped to the rotor in four poles. You'll see them behind the tape there. pair of uh, magnets that go past the tordial coil. Now, the green light says that the power is onto the tordial coil. And the red light indicates back EMF. It just, it's when the switch opens there's a little kick. I don't know if that'll come out in the camera. Just as the switch opens. 
This is the switch open there. Kick. Kick. But all it is is the switch opening of the coil. The red light just gives a little. It will be the kick that Sean shows in his video as the coil opens. But this motor is driven, <coughs> it's not driven by the power, it's driven just by uh, the orbo effect as such. And a uh, little Irish flag, a couple of LEDs. a little bit, it would go up to about uh, 2,200, which would be about 1,100, maybe 1,200 RPM if I didn't have the LEDs buried inside the rotor. Uh, they've unbalanced it and it's noisy as a result. Okay, thanks for Storing our boat through lightning. I think it's going to run over here already. Where is that down? Look at it. 